everyone and welcome back to my channel long time no talk I know I've been super MIA for quite a while now but I was just super focused with school and finishing up my last semester of my bachelor's degree really strong I graduated about a week ago now so uh, that's super exciting and I'm just currently in the process of applying to my grad school and everything like that but in the meantime I'll have a couple months off in between school and everything like that I wanted to get back on here and just film videos because I have missed doing it so much I have so many really cool video ideas that I want to do and hopefully you guys can tell but I did go ahead and upgrade my camera so that's also something that's like really exciting for me and hopefully you guys can notice the difference <laughs> um, so just bear with me the next couple of videos while I get adjusted to the settings and using it and figuring all the cool functions out because you know it is is quite an upgrade from my last camera and has a ton of features that I am still learning so just bear with me for the next couple videos but I thought for today's video we'll keep it with something I already know and love to film and that is my monthly birch boxes so this box right here is for the month of August I just went ahead and took it out of the pink um, outer box that it comes in but I haven't peeked in it yet because I was like you know what we are going to start off with the birch box so what better time it came probably a day and a half ago so um, yeah it does feel pretty heavy so I'm super excited to see what is in my August birch box and yeah let's just dig into it so let's see first thing we have here this box is packed by the way look at this I don't know if you can see I don't want anything to fall out but there are quite a few products in here I feel like it looks like there's more than normal but um, the first thing we see here is by your hair assistant and this is a blow-dry primer so this is really nice it says it's anti-humidity and it is a modifying tonic modifying yeah I think modifying <laughs> sounds so weird to say but um, yeah so this is really cool I'm sure this is just like a little primer you go ahead you spray on your hair before you blow it dry and everything like that and I'm sure it'll you know work really great especially with anti-humidity because I live in Florida and our humidity is always at like 300% all day every day so that's always nice then it looks like these two little foil packets here are by the same brand and this is a prep shampoo and it's a shampoo for all hair types and then this one right here is a prep mild cream so it's a conditioner for fine to medium hair which is awesome because I have super fine hair I have a lot of it but like the individual strands are really fine so it doesn't take much to actually wear down my um, wear down way down my hair so that's really cool and I'm always on the lookout for new hair care products because I feel like I get really bored kind of easily with like my hair care shampoos and things like that so I'm always excited to try new things out then this little guy right here is by Vasanti and it's the Brighten Up Enzymatic Face Rejuvenator. It's an exfoliating cleanser enriched with papaya, microcrystals, and aloe. So it looks like that and it says it is just paraben free, sulfate free, and 99% natural and vegan friendly. So that's really nice. Um, so I love exfoliators. I'm like the exfoliation queen. I feel like my face and I like I don't feel clean unless I've like exfoliated my face so I always like to range between like super mild exfoliators to something that actually have like little crystals and are like more abrasive depending on you know what my skin needs at the moment then this right here is shattered um so this is by Manicadar Beauty and this looks like it was supposed to be an eyeshadow but I don't know if you guys can see that it has been pulverized in my box somehow which like kind of sucks because I don't know I mean I know it's super easy to fix these but I don't know if I actually want to go through it because I mean this is not just broken that like you know where it's cracked this is like completely pulverized into a powder but maybe I'll transform it into a pigment <laughs> like who knows so um, nonetheless so the color looks like it would have been really pretty so that's cool I guess I'll just try and fix it if not then I'll just toss it um, last two things we have in here this is the Key West aloe this is a cucumber under eye gel it says that it's 80% aloe and it's designed to relieve puffiness which I don't necessarily get too much puffiness under my eyes as I do dark circles when I don't sleep 
but there are you know every now and again I do get a little bit of puffiness under the eyes if I haven't slept well and things like that so I do love the scent of cucumber so I'm definitely curious to see how this works out and if I find it's not something that I need I'll go ahead and give it to my mommy because she definitely um, doesn't sleep well so I'll give that to her to go ahead and try out and then last but not least is a Stila uh, this is the stay all day liquid lipstick and I have gotten this in a little trio and this is in the shade patina which I already have because around holiday time I went ahead and purchased like they have like a little gift set I think it came with five different um, liquid lipsticks in this size and it has this color in it because I wear it all the time for probably about the past month liquid lipsticks is all I've been wearing because I have been working so much and my shifts are really long they're usually anywhere from like seven to even ten hours sometimes and I work in customer service um, in retail so I'm like talking to customers all day long I'm eating because I always eat I'm always hungry when I'm at work so I'm always like munching on something drinking my coffee or my tea or whatever and these bad boys do not budge they last all day long and I find the formula super comfortable to wear as well as they don't like dry your lips out and like suck all the moisture out of your lips so I really enjoy these they last super long and so I'm excited that I have another color um, not another color but like another one in a color that I enjoy and yeah that is everything that came in my little birch box this month they do put this little foamy thing but obviously it doesn't work because my eyeshadow came crushed but um, no big deal I'll try and save it if not I'll turn it into a pigment and if not I'll just I'll just toss it but um, we shall see if I can save that one but yeah nonetheless I hope you all really enjoyed watching this video I know I enjoyed sitting down to film it for you guys it feels so nice to sit down just talk to the camera about makeup and everything like that um, definitely subscribe to my channel if you aren't already and be on the lookout for a ton of new videos and everything like that I'm super excited to get back into the swing of things and film regularly for you guys and yeah I have a lot of super awesome video ideas planned so yeah I can't wait to share them all with you and as always I thank you guys so much for watching and I can't wait to talk to you on my next video bye